Hey guys, I'm back with another tutorial! When I started using Medibang, it took me a while to figure out how to manipulate, edit, or transform text in this program. So in this tutorial, I'm going to teach you guys how to do just that. First, you want to go over to this icon right here with the capital T and click on it. Your mouse on the screen should turn into this typing symbol and then you have to click where you want to put your text. Next, this window should pop up that lets you edit your text. Right here is where you can change the font, here you can change the font size, here you can choose the text space, and here you can change the color of your text. You can click on this box and it'll let you choose a color. Make sure this box isn't white or you can't see the text. Right here, you can rotate your text too. This big box here is where you can type in your message. I'm just gonna type in my channel name, M Digital Arts. At any time, you can change the color, the font, or the text size. When you're done, press OK. I have no problem with using the text layer because it can let me easily edit the text color, size, and font. But what this text specific layer doesn't let me do is transform or distort the text freely. To transform and distort the text, you need to get the text out of this specific layer. First, you want to select the text layer and press Ctrl C or whatever hotkey you use to copy on your computer. Now, press Ctrl V or use your hotkey to paste. The new text should pop up on the upper corner on the left hand side and in a general layer. If you can't see the text you copied anywhere on the canvas, make sure you just click and drag around, pulling the text in any direction that would bring it onto the canvas. Now you have your text in a general layer. Press Ctrl T and you can manipulate or distort it. And that's how you manipulate or distort text in Medibang. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like the video, subscribe to my channel, and let me know in the comments section what tutorial you would like to see next.